Hi, this is Raymond Camden, and today I'm going to show just one of the new features in Edge Reflow Creative Cloud. This is the version that came out well, just a bit over 12 or so hours ago. You can download it right now as part of the Creative Clouds subscription. And this feature is going to be Typekit integration. What you're seeing on screen here is just one very simple block of text. If I look at the styles for this, you can see it's set as browser default. Well, if I click on that, go to manage fonts, I can choose between both the Edge web fonts as well as a Typekit kit. So if I switch over to Typekit, I already have a kit uh, that I've worked on called Reflow One. I'll launch the editor and you can see it has one font called Jubilat. If I go to the embed code setting, I can copy the ID right there, take that, switch back to Reflow, and then just paste it in. Now what this has done is essentially reached out to Typekit, figured out what fonts I put in that kit, and actually it's already gone ahead and selected Jubilat. So what's cool about this is that I can actually go back into Typekit and add something else. So for example, uh, we'll pick Proxima Noah. I'll do add to kit. We'll go ahead and say publish. Now what's going to happen now, Typekit is updating itself so that, so that it knows that both of these fonts are available in the kit. Okay. Reflow will not have that immediately. If I go ahead and click here, we probably won't see it. What I can do though is go ahead and quickly save this and I'll save it on my desktop like so. I'm going to close Reflow, quickly reopen it, and when it shows up, if I select my text and go to styling, I should see both of those fonts in there. So that's just a quick example of Typekit integration. Again, there's many other new features in the new version of Edge Reflow, so download it today and check it out.